This is Coogan Cassius for IFL TV. Uh, we're in Saudi Arabia, Riyadh season, battle of the baddest. <coughs> it, right, okay, we've got to address this situation first of all. The maddest thing I've ever heard, I think, before a, a post-fight interview. Martin, midway through the fight, you've swallowed a wasp. I can't believe it. Oh, I'm surprised. Still coughing until now. And with this thumb in the ring, and I was surprised it's in my mouth, so. Did it sting you? Of course, yeah. Where's it stung you? Where? I <coughs> start from here to my eyes, and I was surprised I opened it, my mouth, and it, that's why. <coughs> Sorry. It's absolutely <coughs> crazy. Are you are you feel okay though? Is it? I'm not, I'm not okay, but I'm ready to answer the question. What have the medics told you about how do you sort that situation out? I don't even know how to kind of address this. First, I'm strange to know. I, I can't. I don't know how to explain, but I'm surprised. I was vomiting in, in my change room. I keep vomiting about one minute and I still know. I think it's still here, but I think I'll be okay. It's going to be really sick, sound silly, but <coughs> can you feel it? You know, I feel it. Can I feel it? It's here. It's I think crazy, it's crazy, crazy. I think if we continue, I'll just go to the hospital because I can't continue coughing like this. Right, listen, I'm not going to take too much of your time. <laughs> yeah. Just obviously, you've got the stoppage win over uh, Carlos yeah. Takab, who done his best to hold in there, but the, the pressure and you stuck it on him, obviously. Um, the whole way through the fight and in the end obviously the referee bringing the contest to a close so you must be pleased to have got the stoppage over someone as hard as Carlos Takam yeah I'm so happy I stopped someone like that Carlos Takam is not only 20, uh, 42 years but he's got more fight and more experience he fight Joshua he fight George Joyce he fight uh, Chisora uh, Parker all top guy there I'm so glad to stop him early before, and then everyone else you know it's tough, you can see it's tough and uh, strong. He was ready for me, but I'm too good for him. But you were pleased with the performance, despite you having uh, a small insect flying around in you, and still currently. <laughs> That's strange. I can't believe that happened today. <coughs> but it is what it is. <laughs> I know we spoke about the Deontay Wilder uh, situation before. Um, we don't know what's happening with Wilder at the moment, but I mean, from your, you said the other day that you know if he's you know, for him, the WBA to remove him out of that position yeah. if he's not going to fight with you and him, he's not going to materialise. Yeah, yeah. My team, like a billionaire, on mentioned it already. And he's number one, I'm number two. Why not have the, the fight? If he's not ready, they should take him out. They're working on that. Maybe I'll be number one and maybe challenge or maybe go to fight uh, uh, for the WBA vacant. I don't know. My team, after here, we'll have a meeting with my team to see what is next for me, especially for WBA. So well, you would rather fight. fight Wilder, surely? Oh, I need that fight, exactly. Yeah. Maybe December, January next year. Okay. Yeah. Martin, go and get the wasp situation sorted out. Thank you so much. And uh, so listen, congratulations. And yes, yeah, <coughs> hope it's all right. Thank you. All right? Thank Top you, man. Thank, Thank you. you.